Abducted album, I think it's my personal favorite album. Abducted, yeah. I bought this studio that we recorded the two first albums from and I started to build it and recording at the same time. And actually I made this, uh, The Abyss, the song itself that became a bonus track on Fourth Dimension in the studio. It was actually the first song I recorded in Abyss Studio. It was a time when we knew I was tired and the way we wanted to write and the way we wanted it. Uh, we worked really hard on that album. That really became so much easier for us to not rehearse, but you know, I recorded everything I, I came up with in my mind and uh, to a cowbell just going clock, 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 and then Lars had to go in and put drums on there. So it became a little bit easier to, to create. The song Russell 47, that album, me and Peter wrote in a few hours. We were just sitting in the studio, jamming around. I remember we were doing in, in 95, we, I think we recorded three times what was going to become Abducted album. Abducted, how many times did we record it until we were happy? I think three times maybe? I remember we did it too slow first. Yeah, but also some songs were shit. So we took them away and we wrote new songs. Now I'm talking about Roswell. Yeah, it was going too slow. Yeah. So we re-recorded it. It's still too slow, I think, today. <laughs> but then it, it could have been really, really yeah. doomy. First time we recorded it, we were kind of semi-happy with 10 songs. A few songs wasn't that good. Sound wasn't that good either, because I was still learning in the new studio that, that I was building. And so we recorded again, threw away some songs and put back some songs and uh, uh, writing new stuff. And then the second time it got a little bit better, but there were still some songs that was not good enough and the sound was not good enough either so eventually third's the charm i guess and that's really what you have now on abducted and that really kind of blew the door wide open for us in in, in a way of a response from fans and um, getting new fans and stuff like that so it was a good feeling but still we do, didn't tour that much we didn't really do anything we were mainly just sitting home and writing music and, and things like that and i of course was very busy in the studio with producing other bands in the 90s so that was also another reason why we didn't really go anywhere because i didn't have time so but there you have it on these four reissued on vinyls and CDs.